Hello, my dearest confidant. So we've been talking about how to heal yourself emotionally and mentally and, and physically, right? And I think it's very important to talk about slowing down and taking it easy and doing small steps. If you try to do everything all at once, you're going to have issues. You're going to have a, a lot more setbacks and uh, frustrations and um, you're going to get into a position where you feel lots of guilt and shame for not being further along than you already are. And uh, the more that you can mitigate that, the better, because there's going to be a lot of outside influence that's making you feel guilt and shame when you first start your journey. And so the best way to stop that from happening internally is to take it really slow. And so my, you know, I did it the hard way and I tried to do everything all at once. And so, you know, my suggestion going forward is um, start by just acknowledging your thoughts that you have and um, not trying to do anything about it yet. Just acknowledge, okay, that was actually kind of rude. Um, that was actually, um, you know, harsh of me to say that was, you know, I, I'm not being nice to myself right now. Forget about everybody else, right? I'm not being nice to myself right now and, um, say, okay, that's okay. You're okay. Now we're going to move forward. And I think that you'll get a lot further along a lot faster if you just start paying attention to that. And we'll tie it all in together um, over the next couple of episodes. I'm going to switch it over to doing videos, um, you know, every few days. Uh, so that way you have time to absorb the lessons that you're here for. And um, I hope that you stick around. <laughs> Uh, the road's not easy, but I am here for you. If you have questions, please ask. If you need, you know, you're further along in your journey and you're past the stuff that I'm talking about now, um, but you'd like some other sort of support, like um, I make feather smudge fans, I can do essential oil blends for you, I can recommend um, herbal tinctures and teas and things. Um, again, not a doctor, not a nutritionist, just I have um, an aromatherapy certification and I've taken some nutritional herbology classes. And so I have a little bit more knowledge than, you know, the regular lay person, as well as I've done, you know, some things for myself. Um, of course, anything that I do recommend will be, you know, at the advice of your physician if you're on medications or whatever, but I'll do my best to, to help you. Um, but anyways, yes. So for the next few days, just take some time and just acknowledge that you are thinking certain thoughts, um, specifically things that lean towards the negative side of things right now. Um, absolutely pay attention to the positive things as well, because that's the only way you're going to start to make more positive memories and associations is to pay attention to that too. But right now we're focusing on how to change negative behaviors. And so um, if it's helpful for you to write it down, write it down. If it's helpful for you to do a video to yourself, do a video to yourself. Um, if it's helpful for you to just talk about it with somebody, do that. Um, and if it's helpful mostly just for you to observe and to internalize that dialogue, um, or pictures or however it is that you think best, then do that as well. Um, and so, uh, I'll continue to make other content in the meantime. Uh, we can go over some herbal tinctures and things like that. And then of course, let me know what you're, you are interested in seeing next. Um, and we'll go from there. But the universe said, remind you to talk, take it easy and, and start small because slow and steady wins the, the race, right? So I love you, my dearest confidant, and until next time.